Hi guys, daily challenges, Madame Rizal's location and collector challenges for group one. As far as free roam challenges, we have iguana, horse appearance updated, visit a shop in tumbleweed, we have travel with a wagon, then we have three showdowns, place top three, shotgun kills and throwing weapon kills. For throwing weapon kills, I like to use dynamite, I'm pretty sure those still count, although it has been a while since I've done showdowns. So for Madame Rizal, you're going to be able to find her over here, I ended up stealing a wagon in Cumberland Forest and rode over there to get that challenge done. So iguanas, there's plenty of places to find them. But there's going to be some better places if you're looking to get multiple at the same time. Just a hint, if you see one in the water, try not to shoot it because if it is too deep, you're going to end up having this happen where you're not able to get the option to skin or pick it up. So don't waste your time. Let them get to their destination and then shoot them once they get back on shore. You can find them in the Cholo Springs area, down in the southern part of New Austin here. But all along these islands and the coast, you should be able to find them. And on these islands over here, as well as one out to the west that I first showed, is going to be a great place to find multiple of them at the same time. Also the islands over here, specifically the one marked. If you don't see them, just take off and come back. Now for collector challenges, we have group one. You're going to be able to find over at this area, arrowheads, flowers, heirlooms, dig sites. First two locations are going to be flowers. Then we move on to a family heirloom dig site under the bridge. Next one is a flower. We have an arrowhead at this location. A tarothead, tarothead, tarot card down at the dock over here. Followed by another arrowhead dig site. We have a family heirloom dig site. We have a coin here. Then we move up into tall trees. You have an arrowhead dig site, a tarot card, and another heirloom dig site, and a tarot card down at Quaker Cove. This spot would be pretty convenient for you if you are coming down to this area to get your iguana. But if not, we have some locations over in the eastern part of the map coming up. So these locations coming up, you're going to be able to get your arrowhead, jewelry, coins, dig sites, tarot cards, and flower challenges done. First location was a dig site. Then we have a coin at that location, a piece of jewelry at Twin Stacks Pass, another piece of jewelry. Moving on to an arrowhead at that location, as well as this one, you'll find a coin here, a tarot card, then either an arrowhead or a piece of jewelry at Heartland Overflow, a tarot card here, another one at Heartland Ranch, this location here you should be able to find a piece of jewelry or an arrowhead and then possibly a random item at that location inside of dewberry creek sometimes it could be an arrowhead piece of jewelry a coin sometimes they do rotate even on the same day for that same group so same thing with dewberry creek those two locations are random you have an arrowhead dig site there you have a piece of jewelry these next three locations are going to be wildflowers right there there and there at the dock, you should be able to find yourself a coin or another random item, could be a piece of jewelry. These four locations here are flowers. In Ringneck Creek, you're going to find yourself a $17.95 penny as well as a creek plum just north of it. And then if you need another dig site with an arrowhead, you can find one right over here. And if you're missing some things, you have a coin at the Ian Roads, you have a family heirloom there followed by a family heirloom and a tarot card. And then these last two locations here are both tarot cards on either side of the fence. Last, we're gonna talk about alcohol bottles and eggs. First location coming up here, you can find yourself an alcohol bottle, followed by an egg and an egg on the island. There's an alcohol bottle here in the bayou. Three eggs at this location. You have an alcohol bottle in Braithwaite Manor on the first floor in the dining room. You have another alcohol bottle there. Three eggs at this spot. You have an eagle egg just north. And these last two locations are going to be alcohol bottles. Luckily, this video was able to be short. I got a long day at the airport today, so appreciate you watching, and I'll see you next time.